on the wait, what was the obstacle course that I came to with you guys? <laughs> I the, don't know. The, the, what the one in Oh my god, Texas. um the Tough Mudder. The Tough Mudder. It's just the Tough Mudder of decks. Oh gosh, can you imagine? <laughs> and some of them are gonna electrocute you. <laughs> Terrible. Oh my gosh. It's almost like Okay, don't laugh at me, but it's almost like I'm a wizard and there's this staff. I had like this staff like grows and I hold on to it in the imaginary world and I pound it and I hit the ground three times. And as soon as I do that, all the things that were in that bubble are no longer contained. It's on you now. Your karma times three for me, bitch. Bam. And then I find that I start doing it with my own foot. Like, so I'm like, oh no, am I releasing the Kraken? <laughs> I, I, have, I, have to show you. I gotta back up for this because you got your, your staff three times and you hit your head and you yes. stuck off foot, right? Okay, here's mine and everybody knows what this means. Ah! <laughs> I'm burning your village. You gotta do the, the, the swooping of the big dragon wings yes. and then the <laughs> flames. Everybody knows. And the, the great thing about not actually seeking your own vengeance and just letting karma play its course is that she is so much more creative. Holy shit. When I have looked back at some of the shit that she has pulled on people, I'm like, I like, I want to high five this bitch and be like, oh, okay. So much more creative and she has unlimited resources. I have limited resources and consequences. This bitch doesn't. Stupid consequences. Who started this fucking thing anyways? Why did somebody decide that women should start shaving their legs? What the fuck? Why couldn't the dude start shaving their legs? And it's so funny. I tell my husband and my son, and they're like, ew, it's hair. I'm like, yeah, it's fucking hair. Like, we're mammals, okay? I... You have hair on your legs. Why am I not completely disgusted? Ew, you need to shave your legs. They're like, what? That's weird. I'm like, yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> it's weird so for all straight. of us. <laughs> okay. Not okay. Okay. Not okay. Not okay. Okay. Not I need okay. to extend it. Yes. Yeah. Need more. Need more. Please help me understand need more, where need the need less. There's <laughs> no hair. So it's like, all right, now are mermaids in the Bible? That's like, what I'm saying. Are mermaids real? I feel like somebody's found their skeleton. They tried to sprinkle that story onto us on the History Channel, uh, mm -hmm. and everybody got pumped, and then they had to backpedal a little bit because they really didn't have any footage. It was all CG. Yeah. Like NASA. <laughs> Did you know that every Catholic church has a basin of holy water that you're supposed to touch and then put on before you're allowed to enter? And he's like, so the vampires can't come in? I'm like, you tell me, bro. And now I just want to dig into some other religious texts and be like, what you guys got them from there? Like the Vamanas in the uh, Mahabharata. I'm like, yes. okay, those are spaceships, folks. Those, those are, are spaceships. They're traveling spaceships. Yeah, um, they have the, the layouts of how they build them and everything, like it's a blueprint. <laughs> and people are like, no, that's not true. Yeah, you know, and here's the thing, she's, she's not gonna ever listen to this because <laughs> it takes such a high level. If you're listening to this, you're fucking dope as fuck, first yeah, of all. Yeah, now you're cool. Now so you're cool. fucking garbage <laughs> that you could be listening to that Somewhere in here, you're like, I vibe these bitches. This is a sneak peek of our series called Conversations with Nikki and I. And if you want to hear more of our ridiculously fun adventures, please sign up to be one of our VIP members to get all of the exclusive content.